What's up everybody, I am Crimson Thunder here. Welcome back to this Let's Play of Sentinels of the Multiverse, the video game. The last time we ended up fighting, we ended up going a very, very hard battle against Advanced Matriarch. Now we're also going against Spike today on Advanced. Oh boy, what do we have here? So, all the others apply, and those apply, except at the start of the villain turn, he will gain H plus 2 HP. So, you do not want to bring many heroes right here for this one. Once again, we'll actually bring the Freedom 6 Wraith this time. And we'll also want to bring only two, uh, two others along. I highly recommend that you bring along the uh, Legacy and Ra. And we'll also face him on, on Tomb of Anubis. Because he's going to bring out all those people. And once the a certain drug gets out, I want to be able to get this combo going on so he gets, so we don't deal any, um, get hit by any toxic damage. So we'll take on Advanced Spite with the Freedom 6 Raid, America's Greatest Legacy, and Raw at the Tomb of Anubis. Let's fight. Ooh, a tasty new Morazad. A little worse for wear, but I'm sure you're still be fun. You were once a source of great terror for me. Now, you're a million a shadow from my past. Careful there, Wraith, because he's still out there trying to kill people. So, he'll bring out the safe house. And the safe house would bring along the lost child. Same strategy as before. Don't uh, don't get any victims into into the safe house until he's about to flip of his drugs. Well, go ahead and hit Ra. So, infrared eyepiece. This is a this is an important one against Spike. Reveal the top two cards. He's going to get a drug no matter what, so let's just get we'll only get my pyre. Although I have an idea. We'll first get next evolution out. We'll have Freedom Six Wraith go ahead and use her infrared eye piece again. And we'll just get collateral damage. We'll go ahead and play the Staff of Ra. And there's no point in right now attacking Spite, so we'll just keep. We'll just skip. The environment brings a lot of Anubis out. Collateral damage, we'll lose a innocent bystander. And we'll bring a, a good Samaritan. We will go ahead, another important piece to this is smoke bombs. We'll bring out 4th century since we don't want any drugs out. We'll go ahead and use Inspiring Presence to increase damage. We'll once again use the Infrared Eyepiece to get a good Samaritan on top. Well, I'll go ahead and play his Blazing Tornado. And we'll just leave him alone for now. Environment will be Noni. Good Samaritan and an innocent bystander. We'll leave everybody alone for now. 
So let's go ahead and bring out the mecha computer to reduce damage dealt by the environment. And we'll continue to figure out what's going on. We'll get the potential sidekick out there. The next piece of this puzzle will be the next evolution. No, oh, I already used that. Let's just go ahead and use Surge of Strength for it for now. And just because we can, we'll just get spite. Stupid human durability ain't gonna help. Summon staff. We'll play a living conflagration to burn for another four. And we'll use blazing tornado to burn for another five. Imbued fire. Spike trap. We'll not destroy anything. Strike where we get to. Potential sidekick. On the prowl, we'll just get rid of the, one of the good Samaritans. We'll bring on another good Samaritan. We'll leave, the, leave these alone. So. Why don't we go out and let's see how many so almost all the victims are already out of the deck so now we want to start getting drugs out go ahead and trust fund there's the utility belt and the razor ordinance I'm looking for we'll throw an extra combat stance out and we can get rid of these smoke bombs. Infrared eyepiece and grappling hook. We're not gonna do any damage right now. But we'll we, what we'll do is back fist strike on spite. We'll gung ho on Ra and deal some more damage despite and the legacy rings another part of this puzzle but I think we'll also now go ahead and do imbued fire so 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 everybody does even more damage flesh of the sun god swinging blades this will hit everybody for some for some damage reduced by one by mega computer. Everybody draws two cards. Innocent bystander for a century, and we'll get rid of good Samaritan. We won't do any of that just yet. Now we're gonna now we're gonna go ahead and do utility belt. We can go ahead and do elaborates. So now we're because we're pretty much ready to do we're pretty much ready to take this guy on. Last stand will do some quite a bit of some nice damage. Yeah, I'll be cheating if I just go all the way back to right. We'll go ahead and take some of the damage. We'll discard superhuman durability. We'll let Ra just deal with that. We'll discard an extra evolution. Legacy ring. We'll have Ra go ahead and 
burn spite again. And we'll make him immune and we'll make Legacy immune to any any of that damage. We'll go ahead and discard Fleshless Sun God. Go back to excavation and inferno. Flame Spike will hit Spike 4. We'll go ahead and Pyre for 5. And we'll hit Spike for 6. Lab Raid. And all 5 drugs come out. But most importantly, we get all the other stuff in there. Our challenge of fire. This will increase by this will increase by one from the EMP fire, but it's not going to do a whole ton. So he'll flip over. Now on advanced mode, when he flips to the side, he's going to regain three HP, and all damage is is reduced to him by one, and all the others are destroyed. But he's going to deal himself 24 toxic damage. We can go, go ahead and bounce that back. And now it's a simple game of kick the crap out of him as much as possible. Alright, now we'll play Stumble. And raise the ordinance. We're not going to be able to use a micro targeting computer effectively because of Imbued Fire. But at least we'll be able. But this basically becomes a pure simple damage race. Now we're going to go back fist strike, hit spite for another five. We're going to make for, um, legacy immune to any toxic first. And then we'll go ahead and use wraith to chuck another razor ordinance at, at spite. It'll redirect the legacy, and legacy won't take any damage. We'll go ahead and use solar flare, and we'll burn spite for another s for another six. Head of hit raw for another two. Uh, let's not do th let's not do that. <laughs> Shamais will bring out the Rod of Anubis, which will hit Spite for no for no damage. I think we'll go ahead and bounce and be fire now. That stone bolt pretty much. Did, uh, did a lot of the dirty work. And now we're just going to inventory barrage. This will destroy all equipment. And we'll deal spite for exactly 12. Spite will go back into his little hay grave. And we have won the game. Now this actually can give you a hard time, so be careful about the number of heroes that you bring along with you. And if you if you do a lot of good deck deck manipulation and get out the drug at the right time, you'll actually make this fight a lot easier. And in this case, Spite has officially been thunderstruck. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure you like and subscribe to this channel for all the fun 
and here at Fontenelle's on the Multiverse, I'm Crimson Thunder. See you next time where we face off against Plague Rat on Advance Mode. See you later, everybody.